Hi everyone and welcome back to a brand new video on my channel. As you can see today I'm back with a brand new video on Roblox and I'm back on Bee Swarm Simulator and today what I'm doing is I'm handing in the next science bear quest so I've got quite a few quests to hand in today. I've got the spirit starter quest which I got in the last Bee Swarm video and I've also got the bucko bee one which I think I believe I also got that one in the last video as well and I'm very close to finishing the science bed one I just need to use 32 royal jellies so I think I'm gonna do that quickly now and yeah I think from there what I'm gonna do I hand that in I believe this is the one before the next translator I'm not a hundred percent on that but I'm pretty certain it is so I think looking at it i might maybe do so i got two rage bees uh, i think i might do the rage bee maybe do the one in the middle i've got a lot of royal jellies so let's do this one down here i reckon baby bee and if you're wondering why i'm not using um auto jelly it's because um i'm not really sure how to set it up because i'd i'd want to set it up so it either stops at a mythic bee or a gifted bee but I'm not really sure how to get it so it's like just one of them you know I think when it does it it does them both at the same time so yeah that's why I'm just doing it like this for now and it's kind of like how I'm used to doing it like back in the day surely I must have done it by now let's just have a quick look how many oh I need two more Yeah, there we go. It's gone through. What I might do, hang on. How many royal jellies have I got? Okay, so maybe let's use down to 500, I reckon. See if I can get anything decent. Nothing yet. Just the usual. Honestly, hopefully I can get something decent. I mean, I easily could with the amount of royal jellies I got, but I don't really want to use too many in the video. I kind of save a lot of them at the moment because I'm crafting stuff, so I don't really want to be using up all my royal jellies. Come on. Be something good. I suppose I haven't had a gifted one yet. Like, I've used... Must be, like, getting close to 100. This is, this is like, not really going too well. I'm really not having the best of luck, I'm going to be honest. Yeah, I'm almost down to 500, which is where I said I'd stop. So, yeah. Got 20 more left, come on. Can I get something decent? Oh. Okay, so five, four, three, two, and the final one, and I got nothing. Nothing decent. That's annoying. Honestly, I might come back and maybe do some more later, but I think for now I just kind of want to get on with um, handing in the quests and everything, see what's going on. I noticed... Um, I did notice the comment about the uh, star jelly down the bottom. I have actually collected that now. So, yeah. And I also noticed you said about Spirit Bear has like the most quest dialogue things. You could just skip most of it. I think I probably will do that. I'm The reason I was kind of reading it is because I wanted to make sure I didn't miss anything. Just in case, in, um, just in case it was too important. You know about glitter. Well, so what am I getting? Yeah, I'm not really interested in what it does. Alright. Just rumbling on here. Come on. If you complete just nine more quests, 
I'll give you a spirit petal. Okay, what's that? You'll need these spirit petals to craft the items I'm wearing. Right, that's pretty good. So... Yeah. Uh... So, yeah, nine more quests and I get a spirit petal. Nice. Oh, this is something that could be interesting. So, most things here. Uh, donate something to the wind shrine and many things could happen. Usually it will stir up the winds, spawning clouds and providing perks to certain fields as a means of obtaining a windy bee egg. Yeah, right, keep going on. Why don't you give the wind shrine a Test your luck with a cloud vial. Won't be so coy with you. Okay, so what's the new quest then? 30 million white pollen, 30 million pumpkin, 30 million clover, 2 million goo from blue flowers, 100 blueberry tokens, 25 inspired tokens. Donate one cloud vial to the wind shrine. So I think I might just do the. Because um, I did get a couple cloud vials the other day. I think I had a windy bee spawn. Oh, I only got one. That's annoying. But uh, yeah, I think what I'll do, I'll just donate that quickly. And I think um, what I'll do for the next video, I'm actually going to try and spawn the windy bee. So do that for the first time. Yeah, so I can only donate one. So let's just donate that. Right, so what did I get? So what, what does that bonus actually do? Oh, it just increases some stuff. I got 2 million honey from that though, so that's pretty decent. So, let's go hand in Science Fair's quest, and hopefully that's the next translator. So, let's just go over here. And then let's see what he says. Right, I'm, I'm gonna be I completely forgot why I was even meant to be doing this, it's been so long. These worlds come out to 25% more pollen, nice. Um, just what I need to complete this, a second translator, nice. With new creatures. Complete five more experiments and I may be able to make a third. Right, so, I've got the translator now, which is quite nice. Uh, right, what's this going on about? Oh, cactus filled, spider filled, and ant filled. Oh, it's only 400, that's not too bad. 44 moon charms. Use four stingers, use one enzyme, use one oil. Did he? Okay. Okay, so looking at this, right, I don't like the look of that because I'm trying to save them up. Same with that one. That's fine. That's fairly easy. That I just have to do a couple ant challenges. That's going to take a little while. That I can do the next time it spawns. You know. A lot of this, this is just going to be long, especially the spider filled one. That's going to be really long. But I have got the next translator, so I think what I'm going to do, I'm going to hand in this quest quickly. And then I will head over and give the translator to the red bee. I can't remember what it's called. Okay, nice. I'm just going to ignore that. So, pollen from the blue flower field, right. 
So let's go give the other translator. And I'm going to give it to the red bee. And the good thing is with the actual quests for the drives, that one I just need the pollen from planters. I'm trying to get some more soft wax so I can so I can build another planter because I've only got two at the moment and I've used up all of my other ones. And then this one, again, blown away by Windy Bee. I've got a couple of them, but that's going to take a little while. I'm trying to work out how to um, how to get how to get hard wax. I'm not really sure how to get that. Speaking by the buzzes, give translator. I'll oh, boost some red flower fields. Right. Even though I'm pretty sure from what I can tell from you guys, I think blue's better anyway. What do you with some red extracts? Uh and yourself some righteous rewards, right, whatever. I'll give you a bonus, and every once in a while that bonus may be huge. So what do I have to do? Defeat 5 scorpions, 500 red ability tokens, that's that's the annoying one, the red ability tokens. And then red pollen, 2.5 million, that's really not a lot to be fair. I think what I might do, I might just quickly um, do all of the stuff like the werewolf and that. Okay, so nice little faces appeared, I'll take that. Bro, where are my bees? Like, come on, it should be dead already. Nice. Is it gonna give any more? Okay, there's another one here. But yeah, I think looking at the quests, it seems pretty, pretty all right. Like the science bear one, I can probably get done fairly quickly. It's not gonna be like last time where I'm stuck on it for ages. That one, that's just long. But I think if I get the boosts for it, that could be alright. Again, this one, like, it's really not a lot, to be fair. The only thing is the ability tokens, because that's the thing that I'm stuck on with the star journey, is getting them. And, yeah, the good thing is, the bottom one now is the repair in the drives. Like, I'm kind of part way to doing that, so it's not too bad. I think in terms of crafting ingredients as well, I've already got some crafting. Yeah crafting some glitter because I need that for the two shoulder pads I'm not too far off now I think I need what 35 million more honey I think I need about 30 oil 30 enzymes and then I think glitter after that's done I only need like four more I think so yeah it's looking pretty good for the um, two shoulder pads probably might be the next video considering I'm not too far off I should have that fairly soon and yeah, like I said, another one that I'll be doing is summoning the Windy Bee for the first time. I think that's that's going to be quite interesting. And other than that, I'm not really sure what to do for you guys. So yeah, you have to let me know what you'd like to see. Obviously, I'll see what's going on, keeping up with um, different quests and that. Like this, you know, this video is just a completing a lot of quests type of thing. Just going around doing the little bug hunt thing. I can't remember, what was... Um, Ah, oh, the scorpions for the polar bear. Right, fair enough. But I just realised, wasn't there one where it was like um, goo from? Yeah, goo from blue flowers. Right. I think what I might do for that is um, go and grab the unlimited um, unlimited gumdrops for a bit, and then I'll go up to the pine tree forest and just bang that out quickly and then I'll probably end the video there so just collecting the final few I know that's not going to be there because I did it last night so it's not been long enough I think maybe I might be able to collect this planter yeah if you're wondering why I've got it in this field is because I do actually need the pineapple patch for something else I can't remember which one this is I think this is black bears quest so yeah that's why I've got it in this one Okay, got some jelly beans and lots of gumdrops, which is very good. Because I'm trying to 
Obviously my main focus is the shoulder pads at the moment, but I am also trying to save up a fair bit for the um save up a fair bit for the gummy stuff. But I have just realized as well I'm not going to be able to do the unlimited gumdrops because I did that again last night, so it wouldn't have been long enough yet. But looking at these, do I actually need any of these? I think I do, don't I? Yeah, so clover filled for that one. And pumpkin. Oh, it was almost perfect then. And yeah, I mean, this isn't too bad. 30 million, I mean, it's not the best, I'm going to be honest. Like, it really isn't. But inspire tokens, I think that's fairly easy to get. Well, I might do maybe, because I'm quite close to, um, to that. Maybe just quickly finish that. But yeah, in terms of most of it, it's like it's looking fairly good. Like the quests are coming along pretty decent. Like the drive one, obviously I'm gonna have to summon some windy bees for that. And the planter one is just gonna take time because obviously I need to wait for the planters to grow. I'm hoping I can try and get some more of the waxes, like I said, to um, to eventually do it. I kind of want to do the next one in um, the dapper bears shop. But I don't have enough hard waxes and I'm not 100% sure how to actually get hard waxes. So that's definitely something I think I'm going to have to look into. Soft waxes is something else I'm looking for to try and get maybe either the red or the blue one. Which I think could be quite useful. And uh, yeah. Digital be corrupted to stump field. Right. So whilst I'm fairly close to this but another thing I think I might do maybe is just um, use some more of the royal jellies. Like, just go back to here and use them because I think that would be a lot better. Maybe use another 100 Royal Jellies, see if I can get anything decent. Okay, so I've actually gained 13 Royal Jellies while I've been doing stuff. So, uh, yeah, let's just use up to 400 and then see how we get on. I mean, I know this is quite a long way of doing it, but I think I'm not really sure how to set it up so that it does either mythic or gifted or something like that you know like it stops at just one of those not like where it's a mythic gifted because i know that's going to be really difficult but where it stops at like one of them i'm not really sure how to set that up so if you guys know that then let me know in the comments because i know like down here obviously you've got this but then if it just does that doesn't it just add it on top of each other though but that's what i'm concerned about and i don't really want to end up using all of my royal jellies because like I said I'm trying to use it to craft stuff I mean you're probably wondering why I'm not using the star jellies if I'm looking for gifted but there is reason for that because I'm pretty sure if you gift one star jelly it actually summons a windy bee from what I've heard so five star jellies that's basically five windy bees I can summon which I think is going to be pretty useful later on so I think the other one is jelly beans from what I can tell you know so I've got a lot of them, and the other one is glue, but I don't really want to use the glue because like I said, I'm trying to save up for the gummy stuff. And yeah, I also need to look into um, getting the uh, the red and the blue masks, not the, um, not the main ones like the, I can't remember the name of it, but the one, the demon mask or the um, diamond mask. I'm not going to be able to get them anytime soon. But I do actually need to get the lower level ones, so the um, the bubble and I don't even know what the other one's called, I think it's the fire one. I kind of need to get them at some point, need to look into that. I think the reason I didn't is because I was saving up for the shoulder pads. And to be honest I've kind of got the honey mask anyway, so I'm fairly alright. Come on, please be something nice. We're getting fairly close. Okay, final one, come on nothing right well that's very annoying i've used like what well over 250 royal jellies and not single gifted no mythic or nothing which is quite annoying i was hoping to at least get something like maybe even a gifted like it doesn't have to be a decent gifted but even just like something like this you know if there's one i've already got obviously i just ignore it anyway but well, i was hoping to get something decent do you know what i might just try Will it let me if I just do like until mythic? Will it use up all my royal jellies? Yeah, it literally just used up all my royal jellies. Like, 
See, this is this is why I didn't want to. This is why I didn't want to do it. Obviously, I'll get it back pretty quick. Like, you know, I get that from up there, and I get royal jellies all the time. So I'll get it back fairly quick. But I really didn't want to do that. So yeah, I mean, lesson learned, I guess. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. If you did, leave a like, subscribe, and anything else you'd like to see on Bee Swarm or any other games you'd like to see me do on Roblox. Or any other games you like to see me do. And yeah, I'll see you guys all in the next one. Built a empire of